everybody. I'm just making a couple of little videos explaining some of the questions from force and acceleration that you had to do. So I worked through question one in the introductory video and I think I'll work through question five because quite often every year I have people asking me how to do that question. So I'll just read through that question with you and talk you through it. So a car of mass 1,250 kilograms is towing another car of mass 850 kilograms. The car is accelerating at 0 0.60 meters per second squared. So what does that mean? It means that two cars, this car is pulling the other one. That's the meaning of the word towing. Okay, and I put the masses of the cars there and that's the rope, the tow rope. So one car is attached to the other. Okay, and there's your value for acceleration. So A, draw a diagram showing all the forces acting on the car which is being towed. So that is this car. This is the car that's being towed. The word tow means to pull. Okay, so all the forces acting on that car is you will have your gravity force draw from the middle, acting vertically down. And then you have an equal and opposite reaction force from the ground acting up. So it's in vertical equilibrium. So those two forces cancel each other out. Okay. The unbalanced force is your tension force. So what actually happens is there's tension force acting both ways. And the size of that tension force is equal. Okay. So. Write a vector equation and calculate the tension in the tow rope. Now, the tension force is your unbalanced force and your unbalanced force is equal to M times A. Okay, so instead of unbalanced, I write tension because that is the unbalanced force. Your mass of the car is 850 kilograms and your acceleration is 0 0.60. So... That will give you 48 plus 51, I think. Yeah, so you get something like this, 510 newtons. Let me just check to see if I'm correct. So 850 times 0 0.60 is 510. So that's the answer to A. Okay, so... Oh, and that's the answer to B. Okay, so that's A, the diagram. That's the answer to B. Then draw a diagram showing all the forces acting on the car which is towing. Okay, so that is the car which is towing. So this is C. So you get one, two, five, zero kilograms. So you've got your forward force, all right? And it's actually towing this other car, 850. And there is tension force acting both ways. And then of course, there will be your gravity force and your reaction force. They're equal and opposite to each other, okay? So write a vector equation and calculate the forward force of the car's engine. So your unbalanced force, now the tension forces are equal and opposite. They kind of cancel each other over here. So your forward force is mass, your total mass times acceleration. So forward force, which is your unbalanced force, is your mass, which is 1250 plus 850 times acceleration so what do i get so i go one two five zero plus eight hundred and fifty i get two thousand one hundred times point six zero i get one thousand two hundred and sixty so that's how you get it because they're two masses because they're attached you've got to have both the masses in order to get that forward force because they're both accelerating forwards okay so i hope that made sense bye for now